Calls are growing for Scotland's rubbish tips, dumps and recycling centres to reopen as fly tipping threatens to ruin our countryside. With the COVID-19 lockdown now in its seventh week, they're all closed and some people appear to be resorting to dumping their waste anywhere they can. Sharon Donaldson reports. It's a blight on our local communities. Rubbish piled up and left to rot. Household appliances, DIY waste and bin bags full of rotting food are among the items dumped at our roadsides and in our parks, providing the perfect breeding ground for rats, mice and disease. Rats are automatically drawn to rubbish. They're a scavenger, they're looking for food, they're looking to actually nest. We've come across places where they've actually taken up home and rats just go rampant. Campaign group Clear Waste says since lockdown, illegal fly tipping in Scotland is up 54%. And over the bank holiday weekend, that figure saw an 83% spike. According to SEPA, it's a problem which costs Scottish councils £2.5 million in a normal year to clear up. And it's not just household waste building up. Fly tipping in the countryside means those working in agriculture are suddenly finding waste and rubbish on their doorstep. Farmers are key workers. They're already working round the clock trying to keep the country going and food on our tables. They say they don't have time to be clearing up eyesores like this. Peter Robinson says dumping garden waste and tyres has become a big problem on his farm near Peterhead. Livestock can then eat any bits of plastic or uh, other waste that's within the grass clippings and the tree clippings. There's builder's waste being dumped, including asbestos and nails, so uh, you know, it's totally unacceptable to us. Scotland's 32 local councils have all either reduced or stopped their recycling and waste collection services to varying degrees. But after seven weeks, ministers are now being asked to reopen them. In England, they're managing the process through allocating slots every day. So there's a limited number of cars that can come to a recycling centre on any given day. That lends itself to allowing for social distancing. And I've written to the community secretary in Scotland asking for Scotland to adopt the same approach for the Scottish Government to give power to local authorities to open on that same managed way. In Parliament, those calls are being echoed. We have a problem with fly tipping. Will you work with councils? They want to get these centres open. Will you work with them to do so? It's not simply a, a question of just saying, uh, yes, they can all be reopened. They have to be reopened safely. We have to know that it isn't going to uh, incentivise um, non-essential journeys um, and we have to uh, have to make sure that they can be managed. As the lockdown continues with so many people trying to stay at home and with large items of waste continuing to mount up the public are being urged to hang on to their rubbish at home until they can dispose of it safely. Sharon Donaldson, STV News.